Hello, hello, welcome back. We are playing more mono red midrange in standard. Um, we are going to mulligan this on principle. I don't like five land hands. Just looking at that made me very uncomfortable. Okay, we'll keep this one. <laughs> anyway, I hope everybody out there is doing well today. I certainly am. We're going to play some magic with our brand new Origins cards, our Abbott. I really like this card. It's good on turn two. It's also good on turn three through five. It's actually quite a good card. Um, and by good on turn two, I mean you don't necessarily have to get value out of the uh, exile. A 2-1 prowess for two actually goes a long way uh, towards getting the opponent dead. Now, I'm going to eat my words here if we play this and exile a mountain, um, but we didn't. So there you go. A couple of mountains and we'll be doing well, even though we do stand to six the opponent here. Um, he may be playing heroic or control. There is the uh, Jeff Hoogland list, the hanger back walker blue white control list running around. And if I had to guess, I'd say that's what our opponent is on. Just uh, based on my own amateur analysis. Mountain. Give mountain. Nope. Okay. Ooh, we're going to get in for two either way and keep on digging through this deck, trying to get these lands together. We do run 22, so at this point, a little bit outlandish. Opponent sees the writing on the wall, uh, what with four damage spells and prowess creatures. He is probably searching for his... Uh, black removal. Goodness gracious. Alright, we're gonna race him down as fast as possible. Get our prowess triggers, even if he pulls the trigger on his dissolve, we're gonna six him here. And he doesn't have the mana to do uh, removal this turn. Although a bile blight would kind of eat our lunch right now, uh, admittedly. So... Hopefully, we can seal the deal in the next couple of turns and not have to worry too much about what he has up his sleeve. Although the second black mana is in the cards. Mountain, thank you, goodness. Alright, <clears throat> so now we just slash. He's going to get the swamp. Anything but Bile Blight. Just don't have it. I don't ask you for much. All right. Hero's Downfall. Good, good. <clears throat> All right. So we, in fact, did not get our lunch eaten. We have our opponent, our Esper Control opponent, at six. And everything's coming up Millhouse. Yeah, this uh, game has very much demonstrated the power of Abbott. Um, what was in this slot was Lightning Berserker. Not as good of a card. Just uh, putting that out there. Come on, exile some land. Or whatever. It doesn't really matter. Okay, he got a Phoenix and an Abbott and a Mountain. That's fine. He is tapped out. We can four him here, or we can stoke... No, for four. I guess we just play the Phoenix. Even though it's not the most powerful hand, card in our hand. Um, it's very hard to see him coming back from this. Now, we do have to respect 
um, the possibility that we're not going to be able to cast another spell without getting countered here, but we're threatening lethal pretty effectively. If he puts out an abbot, we kill him with the phoenix. If he puts out a phoenix, we kill him with the abbot. Um, so we'll see very soon if we're going to game two here. He's going to play the Abbot, get some card advantage, Jace's Ingenuity. He's going to cast it, maybe. I don't know. What am I, a wizard? Yep, he will definitely draw three cards. Don't know why. I'm definitely going to kill him now. All right. <laughs> Uh, as predicted, we took game one pretty handily off of our Esper control friend, and I hope that uh, you, my viewer friends, will join me for game number two, and if necessary, game number three, but come on, let's not, let's not be extravagant here. We all have schedules to keep. All right, we'll get it done in game two, and I'll see you guys there.